Hello, in this part of the correlation tutorial we're going to look at the effects of outliers. So I'm on the tutorial notes, click on effects of outliers. And the purpose here is to explore and understand how bivariate outliers are going to affect our linear lines of best fit and our estimates of correlation. So let's have a look at these two applets. And what we can use these applets to do is to work out uh, for any given correlation plot, the correlation line of best fit. Uh, we can plot the mean x and y lines and we can also add remove or um, move around data points. So in this case, uh, you can I'm on the add data option so I can add data points and as I'm doing that I can see the correlation up here. Uh, I can show the least squares line, the line of best fit and I can show the x and y mean lines. For this second example we can add data points. At any point we can click on uh, show line for the line of best fit which gives us the correlation up here and to shift the data point uh, hold down shift and click the point and drag it around. Now using these two applets you should be able to uh, try and answer these three questions where would you add an outlier in order to maximize the correlation? Where would you add an outlier in order to minimize the correlation? Or possibly even make the cor correlation go as far as possible in the opposite direction? And where would you add a point that does not change the correlation at all? So let's have a look at the first one. Where do we add a data point to maximize the correlation? Currently this correlation is 0.59 and if I add my line, uh, another point as far as possible along the line of best fit to the extreme points, then that will have the largest possible effect on the correlation. So eventually if I add enough points out here or out here, I should be able to get this correlation to be quite strong. It's now 0.9. So the answer here is as far as possible to the ends of the line of best fit. So where would we add an outlier in order to minimize the correlation? Well, if you imagine a, a perpendicular line to the line of best fit and you added data points out on that line, then eventually, as you can see we've already done here, we can change the line of best fit to be small and then go in the opposite direction. Uh, the correlation is now 0.72 instead of the, the negative correlation. So the answer here is to place the outlier as far as possible to the ends of the line which would run perpendicular to the line of best fit crossing at the mean for x and for y. And finally where would we add a point which does not change the correlation? If we add data points that are the mean of x and the mean of y, they will sit on the line of best fit and they will have virtually no effect. So I'm adding points here and this correlation is not changing from 0.91. So the answer here is on the mean for x and y. 